Hey, what's going on folks? Dylan here from FabricationGuide.com and today we're going to be talking about choosing the best plasma cutter for your CNC table. The first thing you're going to want to look at when looking at plasma cutters is how is the plasma cutter going to interface with your CNC table. So companies like Hypertherm make this really easy and they actually have an interface port on the back of the plasma cutter. And what you do is you just buy the little handy dandy cable that they offer you. It's already pre-wired with little spades on the end. And this will allow you to interface your uh, plasma cutter with the table and they have a chart as you can see I posted this up on the website so you guys could see a little bit of an example but uh, all of their machines from the PowerMax 45 on up has this port on the back and it'll allow you to easily connect it to your table so you take the brochure of your table you look at what's what you can match them up and you buy the little handy dandy cable and that will allow your machines to communicate you know I've seen people say oh well, I'm gonna buy this machine and you know I'll take it apart and I know what's what it's like Man, that is not worth it. You're going to have a Frankenstein machine and you're going to have all these janky connections and, you know, it just does not work well. So buy a machine that has a built-in interface port. Make it easy. It's already built for this. And that is one of the reasons why Hypertherm is so popular when it comes to CNC tables is their machines are just ready to go. The next thing you're going to want to look at is whether or not your machine ships with a machine torch or just a standard working torch. So this is a, just a standard working torch, 90 degree. Um, this is what you would get on just about any plasma cutter. But what you're going to want is a machine torch. This is a torch that is vertical. They also call them vertical torches. That is easy to mount to your system. It keeps the cord up and out of the way. This is what you want. So Hypertherm actually offers these standard with some of their machines so you can order their machine directly with a vertical torch and then you can order a working torch separate or whatever you'd like you can order it with the working torch and then buy the vertical torch separate whatever combination you like but you can save a little bit of money there if you only plan to use it on your cnc table by just buying it with the vertical torch uh, pre-installed from the factory and when you go to change them uh, hypertherm is pretty easy they just have a quick connect coupler on the front it's super easy and uh, you can get it changed out pretty quick so the last thing that you need to consider is the power of the machine. You know, do you want a 45 amp machine, a 65 amp, 85? And one of the things that I really like about Hypertherm is that they will tell you the maximum cutting thickness of their machines. And then they'll also give you a production uh, cutting thickness. And what that means is, you know, here's the maximum that this machine can cut. But here's what's really recommended if you're going to put that machine in a production environment. So I will, I'll post links to um, each one of these machines in the video description. I'll post the Amazon link of where you can actually get the machine from. But then I'll also post these links to uh, Hypertherm's website that has the specific specifications for each machine. But if you go to the Hypertherm website, this is the PowerMax 45. This is one of the smaller machines. Depending on your usage, this may be a really good fit for you. It's a it's a badass machine, to be honest. Uh, if you go down to the operating data and then you scroll down here, you'll see the production ch uh, cut chart. So for mild steel, 5 8 uh, cut thickness at uh, 45 amps, so that's maxed out on the machine, 16 inches per minute. So that's what you're going to want to look at is the production chart, what your thickness is that you're looking to cut, your maximum thickness, that is, and then what the inches per minute uh, that you that you're going to get. So, you know, if you're in a large scale production environment, buying a machine that's 65 or 85 amps is going to give you uh, a lot faster cut speed, you know, on a variety of thicknesses. So you're going to get a lot more inches per minute. And if you're in a production environment, that could be, you know, time is money. That could be very useful for you. If you're a hobbyist and you're like, I'm never going to work with anything thicker than a half an inch, you know, then there you go. The The PowerMax 45 could be perfect for you, especially if you're not in a time sensitive environment and you could save some money there. But the ones that we really recommend, the 45, uh, the PowerMax 65, as you can see here, as soon as you get to this one, uh, mild steel, you're up to uh, five eighths thickness. You're talking 26 inches per minute. Okay. Stainless steel, aluminum, all that's there. You can take a look at that. And you can even go up to the PowerMax 85. If you take a look at the operating data on this, uh, you're talking three quarter inch mild steel, uh, and you're talking 29 inches per minute. That is, that's, I mean, that we, you know, when you're hearing those numbers, it doesn't seem like a lot, but when you see a three quarter inch piece of mild steel getting cut on a CNC table at 29 inches per minute, that is very impressive. Okay. So hypertherm really has a widespread of machines that, 
uh, fits just about any application. As you can see here, the little thing down here, production speeds are approximately 80% of the maximum for optimum cut quality cutting speeds. That's exactly what you want. You want honest uh, results from the companies and Hypertherm is just really transparent. They have great customer support and I just recommend them to so many people. And a lot of people are like, why do you just always recommend Hypertherm machines? You know, why don't you review anything else? It's like, they're the best out there. I really think they are 100% the best choice. They just have so much good information. They make great machines and uh, they just have everything you need. You just cannot go wrong with them. So anyway, I hope this helps you guys out. In the video description, you will find links to these machines, uh, links to these uh, pr uh, specific pages on the Hypertherm website. If you want to check out the specs, I'll post the 45, the 65, and the 85. And then I'll also post the link to our article if you'd like to read that, uh, get a little bit more information. But I think I pretty much covered everything in this video. Uh, I definitely think Hypertherm is the way to go. It's very plug and play. And if you have any issues at all, I find that their support is very helpful and uh, you can get a lot of really good help over there, which a lot of times can go a really long way. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will catch you guys in the next one. Have a great day.